Good day, my name is Dustin, and I'm making you this quick video because I was searching for drywall in Round Rock, Texas, and I happened to notice that your company wasn't listed in the top three listings that you see right here, right in this Google map pack, okay? So do you happen to know how many more phone calls these guys are getting by having their company listed right here, okay? Anyone typing drywall Round Rock, Texas, these guys pop up, and uh, anyone searching for this, obviously they're interested in drywall and specifically Round Rock, Texas, these guys pop up, they're getting the phone calls, okay? So don't you think it'd be very, very beneficial for your company to be listed right here? Well, I certainly think so, okay? So in this quick video, I wanted to show you how you can uh, do some steps to help get your, your website ranked right here, okay? And get the phone calls that these guys are getting and uh, maybe kick them out of their spot, okay? This is, uh, it's all competition. And on Google, it's pretty much a numbers game, okay? So let's get right into it. So now you know the importance of this map pack, right? Just think of the last time you went and searched for a service. Maybe you needed a plumber um, to fix your toilet. Like, quick and easy way to get a plumber. You type in plumber, Round Rock, Texas. Some of these, these listings come up. You give them a call. Boom, they're on their way to your house, okay? You want to be the same thing. Someone types in drywall. They're, they want their their basement redone or they need a someone kicked a hole or someone got mad and punched a hole in their drywall and they need you to come fix it. They're going to give you a call if you're listed right here. They're not going to go diving through all the search results and uh, trying to find you there, okay? So, not going to beat a dead horse. Let's continue. You know the importance of this. Well, how do you get in there, right? Well, let's, uh, let's take a look, okay? So Google, when they're ranking these listings right here, they're deciding, right? This isn't just random. Google takes into all kinds of different factors as to who they put in these listings, okay? The biggest thing they take into consideration is how well does your website do in the organic listing, okay? So if you got a crappy website, they're not going to highlight you in the best spot that they're going to serve up to their their search people right they don't want to put crappy websites here or crappy companies they want to put good stuff there because they're providing a service to people searching for drywall round rock texas right it's all symbiotic so now you know you for sure know the importance of this for your business now you you have an idea of how you can get ranked in here but you don't quite know how you can get ranked in the organics, okay? So this is two major factors that Google takes into consideration. Factor one, authoritative content, okay? If your website has no content, Google has no idea what your website is about and they're not gonna rank you, okay? If you have tons of content, you're telling Google all kinds of different stuff and how you're the best drywall company in Round Rock, Texas, because you got all this information that you can uh, portray to your potential customers, right? Google's gonna like you more, okay? So authoritative content. Now backlinks, that's the other major factor that Google looks at when they're ranking their websites, okay? So if you don't know what a backlink is, it's essentially a link from another website and it's kind of looked at like a vote, okay? It's like a popularity contest. So if Google sees that you got a bunch of votes coming to your website, they like you more, okay? If you have no votes, they don't like you as much, okay? So now let's get into this. So I opened up, I think, uh, which one is it? Central Texas Drywall, okay? So let's go check them out. First thing we're going to look at, content, okay? This is their homepage. Nice picture. It's really nice, okay? They got some content going here, okay? They're talking about uh, our mission and story, okay? To be honest, they could do quite a bit more content. Like, I would suggest 1,500 words plus on your homepage, hands down, okay? Don't go any less than that. These guys are winning, okay? But they don't have 1,500 words plus on their homepage. So guess what they're doing instead of content, okay? They're probably focusing on backlinks. So you can't see the backlinks. You gotta, like, these are, these are links from other websites, okay? So you can't find the backlinks on here. You need a tool. Okay, so I got a tool called Majestic, and it's awesome, okay? You can slap in a website and see what they got going on in the back end, okay? So here, I'll break it down. Trust flow, they got eight trust flow. That's, uh, that's the link quality, okay? So 
the links coming in, they're not going to be all the same. If you got links coming from crappy websites, you're not going to get much link quality, okay? And then here's, here's citation flow. This is pretty much your sheer volume of links coming in, okay? So the amount. And then here it breaks down even further. Eight external backlinks, okay? So they got eight of them. Referring domains, they got six. This is why I love this stuff, guys. It's a numbers game, okay? If you come in here and do 50 external backlinks and 20 referring domains, you're going to have a, like, you're going to beat them, okay? There's no doubt about it, okay? So more backlinks, more content. That's how you're going to start getting um, up in these rankings, okay? So we just checked out this guy right here. Now I want to prove my point. I uh, went over to the second page. Okay, we're still on drywall, Round Rock, Texas. I'm not trying to trick you or anything. This is the same keyword. And uh, I checked out this website right here, okay? So let's see what they got going on. Let's creep their content. How much content do they have? Not very much, okay? So that's an indication as to why they're on the second page, okay? So if they want to start climbing the ranks, uh, they need to write more content, okay? And if you want to beat these guys, then you need more content, okay? It's, it's all a numbers game. Content's super easy. You can see it, and you can be like, hey, I could, I could friggin' 10x the amount of content these guys have. I can talk about my business all day, all day, all night, okay? That's what you want to do on your website. Give it some love, okay? So now let's check out their backlinks. I threw them in here. Look at this. They got nothing, no backlinks coming back to their page, okay? So the Google's like, okay, well, let's put them on the second page because no one's really voting for them, okay? Why Why are they on the second page? That's, that's the exact reason. The content and backlinks, okay? Remember our first site? These guys got some content, okay? Maybe a little bit more than the other guys, but they're killing it in comparison on the backlink structure, okay? So they're doing stuff on the back end. That's the stuff you can't see, and that's kind of the mystery all behind Google, okay? Google doesn't really want you to know all this stuff because they sell they sell advertising space, okay? They're, there's like the thumbtacks and the, the home advisor, okay? These guys are all charging companies. Maybe you you hired them, okay? They're charging you per lead, and those leads are getting sent out to 10 other companies, right? You're all competing against each other. But if you hang out right here, this is phone call central, okay? Especially the number one spot, two and three, you're gonna have a little less phone calls, but just think about it. If someone's on their phone and they type this in, all they gotta do is scroll down a tiny bit, if even not have to scroll down, and they got phone numbers right there. Three good options. Why would they go down to, th why would they come down here, okay? No, no one's doing that. Just think about it yourself. Last time you searched on Google, how far did you go, okay? Anyways, not gonna beat a dead horse on this. I really hope that this is helpful, guys. I really encourage you, just go out there. Give your homepage on your website some love. It's not gonna hurt anything. It's gonna do better, okay? You have a higher potential of winning this real estate. Right here on the internet, on Google, this is the most valuable real estate pretty much on planet Earth for a local business to be listed, okay? I can't stress that enough. So if you haven't guessed it, this is what I do, okay? I friggin' love this stuff. I have all different kinds of clients. We all work together. We all want to grow business, business to business action. And uh, I know how to get them ranked right here. And they sit there and get phone calls day in, day out, okay? This is awesome stuff. I love it. They love getting more phone calls. And right now, I'm looking for one company, a drywall company in Round Rock, Texas, that wants to work together, okay? I'm looking for someone who wants more business. They can handle more phone calls. If you don't believe the internet can give you more phone calls for your business, then I don't want to hear from you, okay? This, it's simple. People go to Google to search for everything, okay? You do it. I know you do, okay? So why not be on the other end of this and reap the benefits of something that is happening day in, day out? Google gets 3.5 billion searches a day, okay? Get a piece of the action, okay? I'm not going to beat a dead horse. I know I said that already. I love saying it. 
Um, if you want to get in touch with me, I can. I would love to answer any of your questions. Maybe give you some advice on what to put on your home page or how to go get a backlink. Okay, these these are key. Okay, so let's talk about it. I'm going to be posting a link in the description below this video. You can simply click there. You'll head on over to my website, localbusinesschamps.com, and uh, I'm going to have a phone number right there. You can simply give me a shout or uh, contact me on my contact form. Okay, it's simple as that. I'm sure you've done it. You probably have a contact form on your website. Okay, but uh, that's it, guys. Once again, go write some content, get some backlinks. Okay. If you don't know how to do that, give me a shout, okay? I'd love to hear from you. And uh, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. And uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day.